Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today topic is about dinner. Question is about what time we should complete dinner every day. Should we take at 6 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock? This kind of questions keeps coming, right? So there is something called a circadian rhythm circle. Circadian rhythm fasting, this is another topic. So what they do is uh, they talk about what time we should take the meal, what hours of uh, the day we should take the uh, meal, what hours of the day we should restrict taking meal, um, what the amount you should take. So those things are discussed about in the uh, circadian rhythm. This practice can, circadian pra uh, rhythm practice can synchronize appetite with uh, the circadian rhythm and improve metabolism. Okay, metabolism is nothing but digestion, improve digestion. While time restricted eating can help with weight loss, diabetes and cholesterol, it may not be the best choice for everyone. So uh, it's not a, uh, what do you say, Brahmastra for all the issues, uh, circadian rhythm. So people may talk about it, but it may not be for everyone. Again, we should tell, uh, consult the doctor, be depending upon case to case. So to really understand uh, the what time we should have dinner, how much we should have, please uh, be with me throughout the video, guys. Doctor, some people say that we should not eat uh, much in the night. There's also a topic. And if we do not eat much at night, uh, if you don't eat at the night, there are many patients who say that they cannot sleep at night. They also say we don't get sleep. So how should we eat at the night? The question is, when should we eat at night? And the question also is about what kind of food we should eat. Should we eat very spicy food? Should we eat uh, non-veg food? Should we eat uh, chats in the street? Should we eat sweet? Should we eat only curd rice? Uh, so there are many questions people keep asking, right? Okay, or should we take uh, rice at all? Or should we eat only chapati? So there are nutrients in the food, nutrients in the food. What are those nutrients? like carbohydrates, protein, fat, vitamins, and minerals. In this, we need to have a very low, uh, limited amount of vitamins and minerals, but we need a lot of carbohydrates, protein, and fat. What happens to these three elements when we combine them? It becomes metabolism. What is the purpose of metabolism? The question is, what is the purpose of metabolism? What is the purpose of digestion? We need energy and we need power to live. So every day we need some strength, right? To talk, to work, to prepare uh, for the sports, to drive the car. Uh, if, you are a, if I am a carpenter, I need to work. So I need energy for all these things. So we need, uh, we need to have some kind of a metabolism through which whatever we consume, we should be able to digest. So by utilizing these nutrients, energy and powers are generated in our body. Understand guys? So energy and powers are generated in our body. Why do we need power? We need power to be active and work with it. Like what I discussed about the carpenter case. Uh, so we need strength. We need a power to do the carpentry work. Metabolism is a chemical reaction. Okay, Digestion is a chemical reaction. Let us see what happens in the morning and at night. When we wake up in the morning, the speed increases a little. That means metabolism speed increases a little by the afternoon. The metabolism varies very fast. By afternoon, the metab metabolism is very fast and uh, what happens is again the metabolism starts slowing down in the evening. So it started rising in the morning. It went to peak in the afternoon. And by evening, the metabolism slows down. Let us say by 6 o'clock, the metabolism rate is lower than what it was at 12 o'clock or 2 o'clock. Okay. Why the... And... Uh, by the night, 9 o'clock or 12 o'clock, the metabolism is almost comes to 10% or even 
it may come down to zero by 12 o'clock in the night. So in the time, uh, night between 12 to 5 or 6, typically, a lot of people think the digestion will happen when we sleep. No, the metabolism does not happen in the night. So please understand, guys. Mm -hmm. So we eat a lot of carbohydrates, protein and fat. What happens if we eat late night? Okay, if you say I'm going, I'm coming back from the office at uh, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock. I'm having dinner at 10.30, 11 o'clock. A lot of people will tell we have dinner at 11, 11.30. And sometimes people will say weekend we have uh, parties and dinner at uh, late night. And we take a lot of uh, non-vegetarian, we take spicy food. Uh, and we take uh, a lot of carbohydrates, okay, all for the source of energy. Uh, so, this is all uh, what happens and whether digestion will happen or not, metabolism... Uh, could be a trouble, all that will be a psychologically uh, topic to discuss. Some people say that they did not have dinner last night. What happens to us if we eat less food? They say they can't sleep at night. This is a, again a major psychological issue. So eating too much and not getting a sleep or assuming the digestion will happen or not is also a psychological issue. And uh, eating less or fasting in the night uh, is also a psychological issue. What will happen if we are feeding ourselves that we did not have dinner last night? Uh, we should not keep on feeling that, oh, we did not have uh, dinner in the last night. So, it's going to be a problem. We keep thinking that I did not have dinner or I let less or I um, what will happen to me? Uh, so, will my, if for example, if some people who are diabetic, uh, or people with uh, blood pressure, definitely it is an issue. Because if they consume uh, medicines without uh, taking the uh, food, it, uh, their uh, sugar levels may come down, uh, then it is a problem. So, guys, people with uh, diabetics and uh, thyroid issues, please make sure that you don't take any decisions of fasting in the night or eating too much in the night. Uh, unless you consult your doctor and please go by whatever the doctor advise. Okay. And uh, we were talking about the hormones, okay, whether less food or more food, they don't let us sleep. They keep us awake because if you think about food, hormones are produced. Okay. If you keep on thinking about food, uh, metabolism, all that, uh, hormones are produced. So you don't have the opportunity to sleep. So, do, please get rid of from your head. There is a concept of not eating also. Okay. There are a lot of people who don't eat uh, in the night times. Mm, okay. There are many people, they say, I eat only fruit. Okay. There are some people, they say, uh, I am fasting three days a week. Okay. Uh, that means fasting means night times I don't take any food. Okay. Uh, so, there are some people, they will say, we have a uh, function whole of next week. So, I am uh, going out side and we have to eat uh, a lot of outside food and it could be sweet, it could be Bengali sweet, it could be North Indian food, it could be uh, non-vegetarian, it could be uh, chats. Uh, so, all mix of foods uh, will be there because we are eating outside and we don't know the time. The best way, a lot of many, many cases, we also talk about uh, in my home, I eat at 10 o'clock. Some people are saying we eat at 9, some people are saying we eat at 11. Uh, some people are saying if I eat at 11 o'clock, I am skipping the breakfast next day to balance the nutrition. So, this kind of discussion keeps going up, uh, right guys? So, please continue to watch this video. I will let you know by end of this video, what is the ideal time to have dinner and uh, how does it uh, get connected to uh, the, you know, the rhythm which I talked about. Uh, and also how it will help, okay? Uh, so, please keep watching my video until the end. Support me and I will also support you with the uh, correct advice, okay? Even tea, coffee, okay, mm, is also a balanced, uh, you need to balance. Some people say we have a, we have to take tablets at night as I talked about it is, right? Uh, so, should we need the food or not? We I already discussed about this. 
so then uh, the question is should we eat uh, fast that means uh, should we eat uh, uh, early mm, early means uh, when somebody talked about 11 o'clock 10 o'clock should we eat 4 hours before or should we eat 5 hours before or uh, that means is it at the evening 6 uh, o'clock or 7 o'clock the question keeps coming i advise according to circadian rhythm and according to the Uh, the cycle which i talked to you about metabolism metabolism at the 11 o'clock 12 o'clock uh, will end so please make sure you have dinner ideally before the sunset okay at 5:30 6 o'clock or maximum before 7 o'clock and uh, balance the nutrition if you are taking tablets and uh, you balance your carbohydrate also if you have to eat more and but we must eat in the night but eat it before 6 or 7 which is uh, the right time guys so i given you the tip make sure that you eat before 6 or maximum 7 o'clock 4 to 5 hours before the uh, stoppage of metabolism which is at 12 o'clock okay guys uh, thank you for uh, watching my uh, channel subscribe support uh, share with your friends guys and uh, please consult your doctor if you are having different uh, health issues uh, don't just go by the 6 o'clock or 5 uh, o'clock or 7 o'clock dinner i talked about it please consult whether it is suitable but definitely uh, which this is applicable to 90% of the people uh, please follow subscribe and like thank you